comparing two quantities and their units must be the same. called the ratio for heart disease risk and you find it by measuring around your waist and then measuring around your hips and comparing. It doesn't matter if you are measuring with centimeters or with inches. It just matters that you get the waist right which is right around your belly button and the hips the measurement must go around the fatty part of your bottom, the whole way around. Then you'll create a little fraction with these two measurements. If you're a male, you need to be very, very careful that this ratio, waist compared to hips, does not ever get greater than 1.0. If it does, you are in danger of heart disease. Females have a different ratio. Their waist to hip measurements can't exceed 8 tenths. That means their waist has to actually be smaller than their hips or they are in danger for heart disease. Is your body in danger of exploding its heart? Now, Let's see. So, what you have to do is, and you may need to move a little bit, is find the fattest part of your butt, okay? And then compare it to the part that's right above your belly button, okay? Now, if you do that, you find those two numbers, you actually measure with tape measure. Take these measurements, you can determine what is in the danger zone. All right, now we will begin with Mr. Blows. Mr. Blows, will you please stand up and we will compare you to the male. We can have more. <laughs> All right, here we go, here we go. Let's stand right here so everyone can see. Come on. So this guy is not in danger. 
you know, so this guy is not even going to draw a picture of a guy whose ratio is dangerous. <laughs> I am not in the D 